We are able to get rid of medicines only when we use methods that are in step with the laws and cycles of nature. In other words, there are two parts to wellness. First, looking at our body in its entirety as nature has designed it, respecting its laws of functioning and working with versus against them. The second part of wellness, getting rid of medicines, happens naturally as a result or consequence of following this method. Here on Health and Sustainability Group, we bring to you these paths, ideas, and methods to wellness. New Diet System, or NDS, is one such pathway. Designed by B.V. Chauhan of Gujarat in India, it is showing phenomenal results, freeing people of all kinds of chronic conditions. We will be talking of the system in detail soon, but today we will touch upon one of its key pillars, eating raw food. Let's meet two people who got rid of their problems using NDS in as little as 10 days and one month. They are enthusiastically spreading information about the system and helping with ideas for making delicious raw foods. Welcome, Punita Ben. I am so happy to have you here today and uh, for this for this extravagant raw menu spread. Uh, thank you, Shavi. This is uh, is a, such a wonderful things to do it because a lot of people are vegan and. Uh, what is uh, what we are doing, me and Deepak Bhai, is a new diet system, which is if you eat the all day raw food, and in the evening you can eat the cooked food, and 100% I can tell you we're going to lose the weight, we're going to cure the disease, or we're going to improve the disease. And the best thing is like when it is a raw or it is a vegan, so all the enzyme we are saying, and the best stuff is we are not using any heat or no stove. Isn't that great ladies that we do not have to cook, but we can make it very easily and fast within about 15 to 20 minutes. And it's tasty. And very tasty, very yummy. I promise you. <laughs> <laughs> so we are going to make today, I have a list. Tell me Punita Ben, what are we making today? So the things we are make, making today are rasmalai. We're going to make a rasmalai, beet halwa, green sauce, garlic red sauce, soya sauce, peanut sauce, and all kind of like a stuffed vegetable, which is okra, tomato, cucumber, and uh, bell pepper. So we'll make lettuce wraps, uh, and the sauces will be used for the wraps, and right, the green sauce and the red sauce. And the peanut sauce, okay. yeah. So it's going to be like delicious. So I want to ask you, Punita Ben, um, what, do you do raw food diet raw food and since for how long have you been doing it and i can help you with the hummus yeah i was identified with the uh, diabetes my son is a doctor and he told me that um, this whatever you take medicine is not going to cure your disease it's just you can manage your disease and i don't understand all these things but he also told me that it's going to have a lot of side effect and pretty soon you're going to have a blood pressure pill and heart pill and a lot of pills keep going as we are growing older. Yeah. So I wasn't ready for that. So I met Deepak Bhai. Yeah. And Deepak Bhai heard about like a BB Chawan stuff and he just said, oh, my diabetes is gone. Wow. And uh, he said, why can you try? Yeah. So I have decided, okay, let me try. Yeah. So I started doing for about like I did the fasting and then I did the two times enema yeah. which is only time when I was a fasting for 10 days after that we don't need to take it. So you did it for 10 days only? Yes, yes. Uh, and you were like most of it was your condition was like reversed um, in 10 days? After 10 days, what I did, I didn't go and did my blood work right away, but yeah. what I have done it, which is I was eating more like a raw food during yeah. the daytime. Yeah. And in the evening I was eating, making some sense and I have a lot of recipe. Yeah. So, and I was eating like a hot meal, which is a cooked meal. But even by then, after 30 days, yes. I, I checked with my doctor and did the blood test and I'm clear with the 
diabetes. Wow, isn't that amazing? So 10 days of twice a day anima but Yes. And uh, what else were you doing in those 10 days? Um, I have a, like a green juice at about 12 or 1 o'clock. Okay. And Before that, nothing? No. Not no. even water? Um, if you want, you can have a water, but I would say at that time, I wasn't taking for 10 days because okay. this was like, I want to reverse my disease. Yeah. That's why. Uh, yes, so no water. Okay. And 12 or 1 o'clock, I have a green juice, which is about 4 to 5 cups. Yeah. Um, and after that, I have a one, so one, one juice. So one cup is about 8 ounces? I would say about uh, 12 ounces. 12 so ounce you had 4 to 5 of 12 ounces each yes. of green juice yeah, those because, 10 days. Because I was trying to cleanse my body. So what happened, Chavi? Like um, when you take uh, 4 or 5 cups, then you have to run to the bathroom. Yeah. And that was the purpose. Yeah. To and you had clean. already done anima one in the morning. Yes. Yeah. You know, doing it for 10 days and being diabetes free, that is no medicines for the rest of your life. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and on top of that, on the side effect, I lost a lot of weight, Shavi. So it's a good thing. Is look at like you when you are 70 year old and you can do she's anything, 70. you can dance. I mean, can you believe? Yeah. I can't <laughs> believe she's 70 and she's full of energy. She's going everywhere throughout the day. She's here and there in COVID times and she's here today to help us you know cook and learn how to make delicious raw food that's hats off to you Nita Ben I mean it's amazing what you're doing and I really feel that you're going to inspire so many people today yes definitely and every woman should do these things like intermittent by every woman the reason I'm saying that because most of the time if the woman is energetic and do a lot of work in the home the woman the man will follow. Okay. But if you don't initiate, it will yes. not happen. Yeah. It will not happen. And the second thing is like everybody asking, how did it go away? Because we are using in the green juice is like a gooseberry. Yes. So gooseberry is um, especially is a rotorooter, the way how it works with the body. So you take all the bad stuff and this is the only fruit is yes. going to help us to clean and detox our body. So the rotorooter effect I want to explain that a little bit. Uh, gooseberry is called amla and it is very high in vitamin C. Mm -hmm. And most natural doctors, naturopaths, they actually actually tell this to people. If they want to empty their bowels, they should just keep having the vitamin C tablets. Right. And keep doing it till you get basically the urge to empty your bowels. Or literally, I mean, you're not going to get diarrhea. And you could go there if you keep having vitamin C. So that is true. That vitamin C is critical for cleansing our bowels, for cleansing our intestines. You are right, Shari, for that. <laughs> so green juice initiates the vitamin C flush, cleaning and detoxing the body, which is half the journey to going medicine-free in most conditions. There are other things that Punita Ben followed and still does because natural systems are lifestyle changes. Once you experience wellness with them, you never want to go back. We will get into details of NDS a little later, but now let's dive into some of the delicious raw food that we can prepare. We'll start with beetroot halwa. Halwa is a sweet treat, but this is made without sugar. And I'm sure you, your friends, and your family will enjoy it a lot. So we start with some shredded beetroot and you can take as much as you want. And we put it in the blender with some water so we can break it down a little more and then squeeze out the extra water. Save the water to make some soup or broth a little later. You can use a mesh bag to do this all at once or do it in batches, whatever is convenient. Yeah. This is cashew, this is dry coconut, this is um, cardamom. And as Punita Ben is busy with the beetroot, this is Deepak Bhai who has also gotten rid of his diabetes and heart conditions. Oh, well, no. He this, is busy this taking this out the seeds car. from dates. Yeah, paste After de-seeding uh, about 10 to 12 dates, he is now ready to blend them. This is for? This is for the uh, halwa. 
Sweetness will come from the dates. Okay. We just made a... Paste of our dates. Paste of date. Okay. That's for the sugar, we're going to mix it up. The texture not has to be smooth. It's, it tastes like, uh, see, halwa when you see it. And to make it dry, you added uh, almond. I added almond powder a little bit. Huh. Little bit this dry co coconut, dry coconut, and this coconut. Yeah. And now we'll put it in the refrigerator. Cardamom powder to taste. And coconut uh, sugar. Or dates. And date paste yes. to shape to taste as well. Okay. It's not ready yet. I'm going to show you in a minute. So now we keep it in the fridge. No, 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 no. I have to decorate. Oh. Yeah, give me the pista, please. Open it. Mm. I'm just going to write something. <laughs> mm. Write your name. Write. Mm, this is like. Uh, can you cut it? Because it's. Uh, So that's how you make beetroot halwa. To finely shredded beetroot, you mix in date paste, almond flour, dry coconut, cashews, and cardamom. Garnish with nuts and even seeds if you like, and you have an unimaginably delicious treat ready in a short time. It is a rich treat, and a small amount at a time is very satisfying. The good thing is it stays well in the refrigerator for up to 3-4 to four days. The trick to overcoming the strong beetroot taste is the cardamom and how much ever of the date paste that you want to use. The second trick is chilling the halwa before serving. Refrigerate 4-5 to five hours before you have it, even better overnight and it will taste even better. It's amazing how tasty and enjoyable raw food can be. If we learn the art of preparing the right texture and blending flavors, there is plentiful vegetarian, tasteful, healthy options around us to be able to do both. Our next raw food recipe is another sweet treat. It's to die for and it's called Ras Malai, literally meaning creamy nectar. Come back, better still subscribe so you don't miss the boatloads of wonderful ideas that we share here in health, healing and happiness.